Lizzie, he comes back, and of course, it's about the Home Secretary. That there are many issues that have really been front page news of the newspapers over the weekend. Yeah, Rishi Sunak really wanted to talk about better relations with the EU, what the UK is doing to help Ukraine, resetting relations with China. But instead, the first topic he was asked to talk about was, as you say, the Home Secretary, Suella Braverman, who the Sunday Times newspaper reported had a speeding ticket last year, and she asked her civil servant to help deal with it. Now, that's potentially a breach of the ministerial code. And you'll remember that Liz, Suella Braverman was fired from Liz Truss's cabinet last year uh, because of an ins a security breach. She forwarded sensitive government information via her personal email. So the attack from the opposition Labour leader today, Keir Starmer, has been, first of all, why did you reappoint Suella Braverman? Secondly, why haven't you sacked her yet? And thirdly, why haven't you launched an independent ethics probe against her? Yeah, so what does that mean? Does he have to take a, a, a decision? For the moment, we understand that actually he still supports um, Swella Braverman. D does that change in the coming days? Well, she's going to be speaking in the House of Commons later today uh, in home office questions, so potentially you could get developments there. But it comes at a difficult time, not just because of uh, this personal issue around Suella Braverman and the speeding ticket, but in a much broader context, because last week Suella Braverman was criticising the Conservatives' policies on migration, and this week we're set to get new data showing that you've had a record surge in migration into the UK in 2022. Now, this is a huge issue for the Conservative Party. They've long promised to cut migration. And, of course, Brexit was touted as giving Britain freedom to control its borders to reduce migration. But what you've actually seen is that while the numbers from the EU have fallen, the numbers from outside the EU have risen because you've had this post-pandemic surge of students, refugees coming from Ukraine and Hong Kong. And it's especially difficult for Rishi Sunak when he wants to focus on illegal migrants. It's one of his top five pledges to stop the boats coming from across the channel. But if you try to reduce immigration as a whole, it dents growth. And he's got business leaders crying out for visas, for the jobs that Brits just don't want to do, truck driving and fruit picking. Suella Braverman says she wants to see Brits doing those jobs. But if he banishes her to the back benches, she could prove a real thorn in his side.